Hey guys, so Trucker One here, back uh, with a new load. So I'm gonna tell you what is this box about. So instead of getting those chain boxes, aluminum things, I bought this one because this way it's gonna be protected from rain. And most important is when you do power only, a lot of loads will show up with like chain, you need chains or straps like this one right here. But uh, let's show you, pretty, uh, it's pretty spacey. I still have chains on still have some chains you can lock it and this way no one is gonna steal your chains when you're parked for longer in a parking lot so check this load here what i pick up here in illinois not too far south of chicago and i'm taking this to louisiana so check this check this out how i tied it down because it's a power only but you have to secure the load so it's good to have my chains my straps so check this video so i said guys i have my box here with my stuff and here you go, we have this load here. So this kind of like a cooler, something like that. I don't know exactly what is this. And it's a little box here, what you need the strap for. I'm gonna show you how I put the chain. So I put three points in the front. So I have one point this side, I use one chain, one other side, and then I use another chain with one point. So you may think it's two points, but it's just one point because you have just one binder. So it's technically one point. So those people that think they put it like this and they think you have two points, that's strong. That's one point. Two points is when you have two different binders. So I have three points here. And then I have three more points here. So you can see I put this all the way around both of them. And I have the same story, like one point, and then two extra points here. So in this way, it's not going to go forward, sideways or backwards and uh it's illegal so it's not oversized it's not overweight and you can see here i'm gonna show you a little thing here so you can see this one here i put it right there because this one it's already broke so i didn't try to risk it to still use this one and yeah it's uh it's uh, how i said two two straps it's good to have those have the chains even if you do power only it's good to have them because sometimes the loads get paid better when you have your your, your equipment. And how I said, guys, this one, I pick it up here in Illinois, going to Louisiana. It's going to be 900 miles to go. And it's going to be 1200 bucks for me. So, see, I already put some money back on my chains, what I invest on those and the straps. Because definitely cost money. But with this load, I already get some money back from them. And for the loads I already did in the past. So thank you for watching. So if you try to do power only, try to buy yourself some chains, some straps, because you never know when it's a good load to show up. And it's too bad if you lose it just because you don't have a couple of chains. So thank you for watching, guys. How I